Democratic Representative Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez compared the detention centers for undocumented immigrants on the southern border to concentration camps. House Republican leader Kevin McCarthy says Ocasio-Cortez should apologize to the nation and to the world for her comments. I asked Ocasio-Cortez for her response to McCarthy. Mind if I ask you your reaction to Minority Leader uh, McCarthy saying that you should apologize for the uh, comparison between concentration camps and detention centers? What's your um, Well, I think he should apologize for the deliberate conflation and attack on these terms. I think he should apologize for the conditions that he's supporting on the border. He should apologize to the children that have been separated from their parents. He should apologize for, the, for his support for widespread human rights abuses. That's what he should apologize for. And until he stops supporting the absolute dehumanizing conditions on our border, I will not apologize for holding him to account for it. Do you think there, there it should be something done in terms of uh, reforming uh, the, the immigration system right now? Is there any common ground you can find at all with Republicans on border security and reforming the, the system right now? If they want to actually address, you know, they always bring up certain issues, like for example, a fentanyl crisis. If they want to actually fund, I don't know, evidence-based solutions like um, like materials to to assess the actual tankers, uh, the actual boats, and 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 uh, assessing that, then that's fine. But as long as they continue to support, fund, aid, and abet human rights violations, the the conditions that are killing children at our border, the lack of accountability, we have we have asked DHS and ICE for information on these kids, where they are, what their conditions are, and they will not even give us documents so that we can reunify children with their families. This is a human rights violation that has happened on a massive scale, and the GOP is aiding and abetting it. People are dying. We've had 24 people die in these concentration camps that Trump has established on our border. And what they want to do is politicize it, warp it, turn it into a controversy, con controversy about words instead of turning it into a controversy about why kids are dying on a border with U.S. dollars. Thank you. What about the handling of Iran? Are you any concerned about the handling of Iran right now? Yeah, I think they're trying to goad us into a military conflict that's completely irresponsible. Thank you. Reporting in Washington, I'm Nicholas Ballacy.